Hello again and welcome to Heat 2 of the Robot Wars Robot Wars Summer League. Here we go. Now, on to the first battle. Before we start, I just thought I'd better point out Matilda's new weapon. A flywheel on the back, replacing the chainsaw. Just thought I'd better give it a quick plug in case you get confused. On to our first battle. Introducing Duckbot, a robot that looks nothing like a duck, but it has quite a good pushing shape. Could do well. Henry got has seemed to have recovered from getting completely torn apart in Heat 3 of Lego Rock Wars, but it could do well here. And Talos, brought in to replace Raging Reality in Heat 3, did pretty well, making it to the Heat final, but was smashed out by Panic Attack. Who, let me just remind you, it's already through. There's Shunt, our new house robot, did pretty well last time. And hopefully he'll be even more devastating this time. Three, two, one, activate. And it's Henry first to move in Slam's duck bot. In comes Talos. He sneaks in behind and flip Talos over. And I think that could be it for Ian Wilkinson driving Talos. In comes Matilda. Matilda. And Sir Killalot. Sir Killalot. Oh, drops Talos. Oh, Killalot. Why is Killalot always driving in the pit? Bad luck, he's not on the road, otherwise he could get a. Yes, he's almost in. He never gets himself a break. He always has to be in it. Whoa! Talos tipped over onto its side now. For me, Mo! Killalot on the pit. Move is out. Duckbot forces Talos into the side wall. In comes Matilda. Talos trapped. Moving in. Just needs a quick shove from Duckbot to send Talos in the pit. In the pit. Not quite in yet. Still needs a little bit of a nudge if Matilda can get through. <laughs> there goes Talos on the pit and down. Hmm, cease. Talos goes out, Duckbot and Henry, they go through. And so, on to semi-final two. Starring R2-D2, brilliant design, will definitely be nominated for the Best Design Award at the end of this tournament. High ground clearance though, so easily flipped. Supernova has no weapons, no, has a very good pushing power, and a very low ground clearance, so shouldn't be flipped. And Tantrum did pretty well in round in well, in Heat One of Rock Wars, making it to round two, where it lost to All Talk. Three, two, one. Ah. Activate. Supernova first to move in slams R two D two and Talos. Oh, no, not Talos. Supernova. There, there's Tantrum with that great useless thing on the front. Oh my, what am I saying here? Ah, uh, so kill lot. Fixed in his own special hidey corner. Flips Tantrum. Tantrum pushed into the DP dead though. In slams the kill lot. Tantrum is in trouble. R2D2 almost having Supernova in the pit there. So kill lot out on Supernova pursuing Super R2-D2 coming in there. In comes BASH! From aiming there. This is Tantrum. Spin away. And in the pit. Down goes Tantrum. And, and it's R2-D2 and Supernova who go through. Supernova. He's so lifted up. Oh dear. Oh. Fell over before he could get to the flames. Oh dear. Invisible flames, of course. Anyway, that takes us to the end of part one of Heat 2. Hope you can join us after the break. See ya!